All right, Chris, well, here comes the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion, Jeremy Elliott. I don't know why we're starting off the show with Jeremy Elliott, Hutch. To me, come on. Oh, please, last time we were in Fort Erie for Jay Moore Wrestling, we had to deal with him starting off the show, and Cody Deaner talking for a half hour, Jesus. Cody Deaner's amazing. How dare you use Cody Deaner's name in vain, Hutch? And here comes your champion. There he is, the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion. That's right, your heavyweight champion, not mine. My heavyweight champion's coming out tonight, Custom Marcus Ryan. I cannot wait till Custom takes that belt off this Jamoke in the ring. Uh, Custom Ryan is chomping at the bit to get his hands on the Crossfire Heavyweight Championship. Everybody knows that, but I don't know if they know how badly this man wants that title. We're looking for a hell of a main event tonight, Chris. You're right, Hodge. Miss before I hand over the mic to do our reigning champion, before I said champ, happy birthday. Oh, come on, trying to get Jeremy his birthday Elliott. over. What is this? Well, I didn't really want to go on about it, but it is the champ's birthday today, but... Nobody likes to be reminded of how old they are when you're getting up there. And what better gift could Jeremy Elliott get on his birthday than losing that heavyweight championship oh, to please. Custom Marcus Ryan? What Lyle. better gift can he get than once again having a chance to beat the heck out of somebody well, who's uh, in the infamous five? Well, come on, honey. I would like to take care of a little personal before we get out of business. You see, I made my debut one year ago today, right here, bring the heat three. Oh, quit bringing that up. A dark day on wrestling if you tell me, Hodge. And I want to tell you, first of all, how humbled, how honored, and how proud I am to be called your heavyweight champion. Yeah. We have brought this belt farther than it's ever been in the history of this company. We have brought it to the Scotiabank Center in Niagara Falls, the Fort Erie Native Center, the Dunville Arena, but of course we always come right back here to our home, right here at the Meredith Community Center. Cheap pop. So I just tell you guys, hey, um, we're talking about this belt. This belt isn't my belt. This is our belt, thank you. Absolutely right. The People's Belt, Crossfire Wrestling, the People's Wrestling Promotion. Thank you, Jeremy. Right here in St. Catharines, the American Community Center, where we've got great security, well, and they've made sure Jay Moore, Moore isn't here today. Right here. People's I Belt. I know there's lies. some of you infamous five back there, and I want you to get out here right now. And that includes you, Classic Chris. Oh, you wow. Get up that table right now. Get up to the apron. Hey, you play the infamous five music. I want them out here right now. Let's go. Get out of here, Chris. You're being called out, big guy. What do you want me to say? I'm a little shocked about this myself. Hopefully, somebody will uh, get their hands on classic Chris here, the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion, calling out my broadcast colleague. Go get your boys. Go get your boys. Where are they? I know you're with them. Go get them. That's right. Drag your feet, young man. What's this? Oh, Marcus Ryan has a present. He's got a present for the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion. It's a chair. It's a birthday present. Oh, man. What a bunch of nonsense. All right, all right. Cut that music. Oh, this picture is not complete. No Jay Moore, no Cody Diener, the infamous five, a shell of its former self. who is not here today thanks to our fabulous Marin Community Center security team. That's right, he does suck. Showed up at Dunville with no crossfire security. Frank Newman wasn't there, nobody was there. It was one of our first times going that far, and he took advantage. So we're paying attention. I know. You guys all got some cell phones back there. Chris? You got one right over there. Go back to the back. Strike two, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's 
You go back to the back. You text him. I don't care where he is. I don't care what he's doing. You go and find him. You make sure he gets down to this building before the show ends tonight. When the main event, the final bell goes, and by the way, Custom, I'm still the heavyweight champion of the world. That's right. You bring me Jay Moore. I want Jay Moore. We want Jay Moore. We want Jay. We want Jay. Wow, well, that is a we chant I never thought I would we hear with Jay. any seriousness Don't behind it. Him. Right but now. this crowd understands the facetious that nature Jay of that cheer. Yeah. That's right. Jay Moore definitely showed up here today, was stopped by our security team, and I'm sure he's skulking around somewhere in the infamous five, the infamous four as it is today. You're going to be able to find this him. This is ridiculous, Hutch Henry. Who the heck does Jeremy Elliott think he is? It's amazing. It's the infamous five, and even with Cody Dieter and Jay Moore not here, there's still six of you guys up there. Talk about one-sided. No, this is ridiculous. Anybody who takes you guys on is taking on more than one person, that's for sure. Every calling time me, out of the game. Calling me out, Jay Moore's a grown man. <laughs>